Yeah, so I still have the Moto Z here. The Moto Z Droid, as you can see, on Verizon. And the Z line of devices on Verizon just got a new update to 7.11. 7.1.1 Android. So I'm just going to show you real quick. This, this is going to be a quick video because there's not a lot of new additions, but there are some very welcome additions. Um, prior to getting the update, I did have this launcher running on top of this. Um, I downloaded it before. And you know it gave me the the nice little effect here. As you can see, when you go from screen to screen, it blurs out the background, which is pretty nice. Um, it gives you like the new app drawer. Um, it gives you the whole new look. So this is essentially this is like the Pixel launcher, but on Motorola devices, as you can see here. But with the update, it added some extra things because before the update, you didn't you did not have the round icons, as you can see for like the camera and the contacts file manager and things like that and also the new update brings duo pre-installed which I already had it installed so it's just there as you can see the email icon so you get the round icons here you also get um, if you go the settings you actually see that you can allow for home rotation so now on your home screen you can turn your screen this way and you can still use it which is pretty awesome because not a lot of um, home screens support this at least not the stock ones at least so that's nice and of course as you can see you have Google Now Launcher to the left which is awesome and the next thing that they added that the new the update had added that you wouldn't have before the shortcuts so when I click on here I can really quickly I can start a new conversation if I go to photos I can say I'm feeling lucky or I can free up some space right from the home screen uh, I think there's no, nothing for that, but um, Hangouts as well, voice call, video call, chat. I love Hangouts. I wish Hangouts was like the main, the main like messaging app for Android. You know, to compete with compete with iMessage. Um, what else? I think Instagram does have shortcuts. Nope. I think uh, Messenger might have shortcuts. No. Nope. Duo should definitely have shortcuts. Maybe Yellow. All right, but yeah, any app that supports the shortcuts. Uh, you'll be able to start um, new things from the, from the home screen, which is dope. Um, well, real quick, let me show you guys. Let me go to the settings screen and actually show you that I am, as you can see, 7.1.1. And same old thing, you hold it. I think a cat shows up, huh? Okay. But yeah, other than that, what else have we got? Let's go to the Play Store real quick. I'll show you guys. Um, as you can see, you got new emojis to mess around with. If you if you're an emoji person, let's see what are the new ones. Like I know some of them kind of just change um, the way they look. You got an astronaut here. I don't think I was there before. I don't delve too deep into the uh, emojis, so I might not know which ones are the new ones. I think these ones are new, or they just look different. We got a person juggling over here. So you got the new emojis as well, which is nice. Hopefully Motorola will be quick about doing the Android O update. That will definitely be very nice of them. But yeah, so you get the new emojis. I think there's a bunch of new animals in this one. I think the fox might be new. There's the unicorn. You got the rhino rhinoceros. That looks new. I don't think I've seen that there before. But yeah, so you got new mo new emojis as well. So I think that's those are the main updates that were added with the um, Intro 7.1.1. Of course, um, I don't know if I mentioned this already, uh, but you're also now at the July 1st security patch. So yeah, we're in August, so technically we're already a month behind, but that's pretty good. We're almost up to date on that as well. So that's the short little video on the Android 7.1.1 update. Um, I like it. I like this new launcher. I still prefer Nova Launcher as my launcher to use, but I like that this has Google now right to the left, which is always nice to have that really quickly. Um, if Motorola wanted, like, I wish they could add like gestures because that's the one thing that keeps me going back to Nova is the gestures, where I can just kind of swipe down and get my notification. I can swipe up to for app search, you know. It's just there's just a lot of things that Nova adds that the Google Launcher does not have. But yeah, so but that's the beauty of Android, though you get to use your phone how you want it. So that's the my short video on the Android 7.1.1. Let me know if I missed anything else. How are you guys liking your Moto C device if you're having one? 
still still enjoying mine with the mods and everything. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.